to the big game as Dr Chandler's Grammar School versus Chesham High School. We interviewed the Chandler's team earlier to find out how they are preparing for the match. So, Robbie, you've uh, been described as an influential character in the team. Why is this? You don't know? <laughs> no? <laughs> Excellent. Biggest moaner. Um, it would probably have to be Robbie Matthews against White Valley when he told Luca that he was f***. <laughs> People can do what they want in their own time, but within, on match day, yeah, it's about the game. What are your chances to score in time, Robbie? Pretty minimal, I'd say. <laughs> Are you going to score tonight? <laughs> when I was put on those tapes, under shorts, Nike armour with sleeves showing through and hair, I'm going to look gun. We've game. spoken to George about that. Um, I mean, it is, it is a problem in his life, but he's, he's been to the rehab. He's spoken to doctors and he might still enjoy a bit of Pokemon, but not on match days. Best bloke, without a doubt, James Donnelly. Donners. I love you. Donners is world class. Donners is just one of the, he's just one of those blokes you meet once in a lifetime. <laughs> Donners is a top bloke, I love him. He's just such a great guy. And he's so good in the change rooms. <laughs> Especially in the change rooms. <laughs> so there we have it. And now we're going over to Chesham United Football Ground with our commentator Clive Clive for the Bucks County Cup final. It's the big one. That's right, and Chesham are on the attack. That's a good ball in, oh it's a good save by, by the keeper, comfortable save, but he had to get down well. Luca in goal there. It's Chandler, the stack swings it in. Matthews, Matthews is back post, he scored! He scored but no! Wait, the ref has disallowed it. The ref has disallowed it, I'm not sure why, probably wasn't looking. That's not fair on Chandler's. It looked legitimate to me. It's dobbing the way there, it's nice to see. It's stack, stack on the corner, swings it in. Headed out, he's got two good feet. Stack, the defender at six and sevens. Stack swings it in. Matthews at the back post. Matthews has scored. He scored for Challengers. Oh no. It's happened again. Who would have thought it? It's been disallowed. I'm not sure why. And that is how the game ended. It was nil nil after extra time. And now it goes to penalties. Those are the two men who can make the difference. It's the goalies. And now it's Cheshire with their first penalty. It's a big run up. He scored. Good penalty. 1-0 Chesham. James Donnelly is the people's favourite. Donnelly, hand to it, but it's in. Keeper got a hand, but he scored anyway. It's 1-0. Keeper not happy with that one. That's a goal. 2-1 to Chesham. Harrigan. Oh, that's a brilliant dummy. That's brilliant. You don't see that every day. That's beautiful. Beautiful to watch. It's Harrigan again. He's biding his time. Mind play. Harrigan steps up. In off the post. Brilliant penalty. 2 all. Cheshire runs up. He saved it! He saved it! Saved by Luca. What a save. Let's see the replay of that one. He dived down low to his right-hand side, and that's truly a momentous save. It puts Dr. Challenger in the driving seat. Oh, that's a truly brilliant save. You don't see that every day. You really don't. Let's see the next penalty. It's Andrew Gledhill. This is a big run-up. He's walking the wrong way. He turns around. Gledhill with the run-up. Good penalty, he scored. Challenge is free to up, we're in the driving seat now. In the driving seat. Who needs to score this? And he does. Keep it went the right way, but nothing you can do about that one. It's a shame. It's Stack. Striker by name and reputation. And fact. Stack, oh, that's brilliant. Truly brilliant. Said the keeper the wrong way, he really is. Lazy. He needs to score this to stay in the tie. It's been saved! It's saved! Challengers win the cup! Who would have thought it? The players stream over to welcome their keeper, the Italian stallion. Everyone's delighted. There's a bundle on the pitch. The crowd are on the pitch. I think it's all over. It is now. And the players having a bit of a relax. Oh, they're going over to the fans. They've been brilliant to support today. They've been truly brilliant. It's really nice to see this. It's really nice. Lovely applause from the crowd, lovely applause from the players. It's really been a triumphant day. They've worked hard and long for this. Mr. Devon writing in his programme notes, they've been ups and downs, they've been highs and lows. But this is truly the biggest up that they've had. And they're getting the medals now, there's Blood Hill. And here is the captain, James Satterthwaite. He's got the trophy in his hands, all he needs to do is lift it. And he does! Challengers are champions of Bucks. 
They've done it again under the light guidance of Deadman. This is truly... Oh, Robbie. Cheeky little Robbie. He's got his hands on the cup himself there. I wonder if we can have some kind of post-match interview with him. Maybe a quick chat. Robbie, post-match comments? Uh, it was a tough game. Both played well, you know. Kept working hard. It's game two halves. It's good stuff. You look yeah. good. That's what's important though. Isn't it? You look good. That's do I? Have I got good hair? It's wet, good. isn't it? So it's a little bit. One blue. I think now we can we can see the. This is the save that won it. Brilliantly diving low to his left. That's brilliant work by the keeper. He's really got every right to be pleased with that one. And there's Jim Sutterfly. There's the moment it was won. Challengers are champions of Bucks.